Abu Simbel was the greatest temple of Ramses II, Egypt's mightiest builder. But if not for modern engineering, it might have been destroyed. Built in 1255 BCE, the temple was a totally unique site. And because Ramses did nothing small, it was massive, with four 66-foot-high statues of the God King. However, it was nearly lost in 1959, when Egypt's plan to build a dam on the Nile meant the site would soon be under a giant lake. So Egypt appealed to UNESCO for help, and an international team gathered to save Abu Simbel. Early plans explored the possibility of enclosing the temple in a clear underwater dome with viewing platforms and glass elevators. Others considered raising the 250,000-ton site above the floodwaters on a floating barge or a series of hydraulic jacks. However, all of these solutions carried a major risk of damage. But then in 1964, it was decided to carve up the temple into more manageable 20-ton blocks, then move it higher up on the cliff piecemeal, and racing against the rising water. By 1968, Ramsey's greatest monument was safe and dry. To find your own strategic solution to the collapse of the Bronze Age, be sure to check out Total War Pharaoh on October 11th.